roads, streets, rooftops, driveways, and sidewalks. We see these every day and probably don't think about how they contribute to water pollution. In natural landscapes, most rainwater soaks into the soil. However, in urban areas, hard surfaces such as driveways, sidewalks, and streets prevent rainwater from soaking into the ground. Rainwater that does not soak into the ground is called stormwater runoff. As stormwater runoff flows over hard surfaces, it can pick up pollutants such as motor oil, metals, pesticides, and litter and carry them into storm drains which flow directly into local creeks and the San Francisco Bay, causing water pollution. One solution to water pollution is to add green stormwater features to our communities. Green stormwater features mimic natural landscapes and allow stormwater runoff to soak into the ground and be filtered by soil and plants or be collected for later use. For example, pervious paving surfaces let rain and stormwater runoff flow through and then soak into the soil below. Bioretention areas allow stormwater runoff to soak in and be filtered by soil and plants and rain barrels and cisterns store rainwater for later use, such as irrigation. Green stormwater features reduce the amount of runoff and pollutants flowing into storm drains and local creeks. They also reduce local flooding, increase green spaces, attract pollinators like butterflies and bees, and conserve water. Learn more about green stormwater features and how you can add them to your project at mywatershedwatch.org.